Well, the next time you hail a ride on Uber, the person who picks you up may have a criminal history. Yeah, tonight the company says that it is relaxing screening requirements for drivers. New at 11, ABC 7 News reporter Katie Marzul. Petty theft, forgery, drug possession. Your next Uber driver may have been convicted of one of those crimes. Okay, just completed. Uh, I'm going to rate this mofo the usual four star, non tipping, crackhead looking. But uh, that's what we're getting here cheaper rides, cheap ass uh, passengers. So uh, it's funny because I've mentioned that before in a past video. Uh, you know, shady characters. Um, let's see, where the hell did I end up? Let's see. No, I could get the freeway here. But, okay, I'm good. I know where I'm at now. But yeah, so uh, after the last video, it's funny. Um, Uber now, safe rider fee, right? Now they're uh, making it easier. Coming for you, Katie? What about your books? All ready to read them. So that means as a passenger, you, uh, you're you going to have to be careful what you say because uh, with it being cheaper and with uh, now criminals, once a criminal, always a criminal, they're non-violent offenses. You get all kinds of information from people. You know when they're leaving how long more or less they're going to be gone by where you take them if they're going out for dinner hey you got a few hours taking them to the airport they're going to be gone for a while so so that's uh one safety issue the next one will be uh focus more on driver safety um it's getting dangerous now because like i said cheap cheap riders but now the main one coming up next so until then tip your uber driver